Okay, so this is my first update on the 2019 Cancer Awareness Build. And just as a reminder, I'm building this uh, Ravel 68 Chevy Chevelle SS 396. And I have to say that this is probably one of the best kits uh, that I have um, done in a while. I mean, quality-wise. Um, the, the, it's just... It's just really, really good. Um, I've been having a lot of fun building this one. So um, if you don't have this kit, um, I would highly recommend it. It's just a really, really good kit so far. Um, so okay, let's get on to the update here. We'll show you what show you what we've done. I'm gonna I'm gonna tilt the camera down just a little bit. There we go. Move that out of the way. Okay, so first off, we've got the engine done and mounted onto the chassis. Um, so you can see that we did the engine block in orange. Uh, that's what the instructions called for. Um, and then a lot of the detail is just in uh, semi-gloss black. The, um, the headers are in uh, just done in steel. And I did, um, this is the first time that I used a <clears throat> an aftermarket um, distributor with wires. Uh, and so I was really pleased with the way that came out. Um, so we did wire that. <clears throat> Give you a little more, a little better look up here on the, the front of the engine. Um, this this kit comes with uh, decals for the engine. You see, there's a decal there uh, on one of the valve covers. I uh, don't know if you'll be able to see it or not, but there is a uh, there's a decal on the uh, on the oil filter AC Delco uh, decal on the oil filter. Um, and so there's the uh, the engine in place and and uh, a part of the the chassis um, the engine if I were guessing probably there's probably between 15 and 20 parts just for the engine uh, itself and so um, like I said I'm, I'm very impressed with this kit so far so there is that and then we've also done some work on the interior um, there's one of the one of the seats uh, and I went with for my my color is if I can find it here it is it's a um, this is a rust-oleum um, it's called ultimate ultra matte and it's just a slate color so it's kind of a kind of a gray gray color and uh, you can see there's some buttons there on the seats I've done those in Chrome, uh, and then I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go over those. Just lay over those some uh, transparent or some clear green, um, because uh, while we're doing the build, really for colon cancer, um, my patient's cancer actually spread to the liver. So we're gonna do a little bit of green, uh, which is for liver cancer. So just some some small green accents uh, on the interior so there's one of the seats of course the other one looks looks just like it uh, we've got the back seat here uh, and it's done you know done the same way the uh, the door panels uh, we've uh, we've done with some chrome accents and then we'll do we'll also do some uh, some green I'm not going to do all of the chrome in green but uh, we will do some some green uh, accents on the door panels uh, and probably um, dry brush over the uh, the speaker uh, grills so there's that and then we've got the dash the dashboard um, I've done some some chrome on that uh, th there are decals there are actually decals for the instrument panel that come with this um, and so there is that. It does have a, uh, here's the center console, and it's just primered right now. I'm actually gonna do this in a semi-gloss black just to, just to give a little bit of, a little bit more contrast in the, 
interior so this will be done in in a semi-gloss black um, let's see what else oh I, I am going to um, I'm gonna do some flocking on the uh, on the interior so I got this this is the Ken's uh, fuzzy fur and it's just a charcoal color so this will go on the on the floorboards uh, and probably the the back uh, the back, you don't call it a dash, but on the this back part here, it'll be that'll be done in the in the flocking also. And then finally, uh, for now anyway, we do have the body painted, or it's got uh, it's got a few coats of paint on it. Um, and this light really doesn't do this color justice. It almost looks kind of purple. And when you get it out in the sunlight, you can see that it's really got some nice metal uh, metal flake in it. Uh, but this is the uh, TS-53 Deep Metallic Blue um, Tamiya Spray. Uh, and as I said, this is, this is, just, uh, this is just paint so far. Um, I, I have not cleared it at all. Um, not done any wet sanding or anything on it. So... Uh, that's just kind of where we're at with it right now. So uh, there is that. And I guess for now, uh, I have done, I don't have as many coats on the hood as, as on the body. So this one, this one still needs a couple more coats uh, added to it. So uh, there's, but there's the hood. Um, and so that is that is our update so far with the 2019 Cancer Awareness Build. Um, hope to have a, a uh, update on the Back to the 60s build here in a day or two. Uh, but that's what we've got for now. Hope you all are having a good start to your week. I'm glad to see that everybody made it back safely from the Acme Show. Thank you all for watching. Have a great rest of your week, and we'll see you next time around. Talk to you later. Bye.